Turkey has condemned the latest Al-Shabaab attacks in Somalia. We are very saddened when we learn that many people, including officials and civilians, lost their lives and were injured in the terrorist attacks that took place yesterday in the cities of Afgoya and Marka in Somalia. Ankara is a key security partner for Mogadishu, having trained thousands of soldiers and police at their own facilities. Turkey has even constructed such resources inside Somalia. The Hamarkhad forces are among the most respected in the country. In their statement, the Turkish government also called on the world to work closely with Somalia with the sole aim of defeating al-Shabaab. The sentiment is strong and important support for Mogadishu, but here Turkey has an opportunity to lead the way. Turkish drones are among the world's most sophisticated and effective. The Bayraktar TBT-2 is a long-range tactical device that can carry four smart payloads per mission. It flies 150 kilometers an hour, up to seven and a half kilometers over its target. Carrying weapons up to 150 kilograms, it has proved effective in both Libya and Ukraine and is now sought after by militaries around the world. Forbes magazine has called it the most valuable player in the opening months of the Ukraine war. Oryx, a military observation blog, says the TB2 has damaged or destroyed 10 helicopters, 6 armored fighting vehicles, 6 naval ships, 5 artillery systems, 3 command posts, among other Russian assets. 50 have reportedly been deployed in Ukraine. A smaller number aimed at the al-Shabaab could have a significant impact and perhaps accomplish what President Hassan Sheikh Mohamud is hoping for, get the terrorists to the bargaining table. Turkey should lead the way in its proposed international solidarity with Somalia and send some TB2s to Mogadishu. ADN-TV will continue to report on security developments across Africa.